Finding the product using the multiplication table. We have learned about the multiplication table before. Remember how it looks like? The rows and columns both stand for digits from 1 to 9. And each element in the table is the product of its row and column numbers. Let us use the multiplication table to solve multiplication problems. What is the result of multiplying 5 times 4? We can write the problem as 5 times 4 equals some value that we don't know yet. So we put a question mark after the equal sign to represent the unknown value. To find the unknown, we need to know which row and column to look for. 5 represents the row number and 4 represents the column number. What is the value of the element in row 5, column 4? If we start at row 5 and move across 4 columns to the right, we get to 20. Now, we replace the unknown in our equation with 20. Let's try another one. What is 6 times 9? Since the product of these two numbers is missing, it is the unknown. So we rewrite the sentence like this. Here is the multiplication table. Start from row 6 and move across 9 columns. What number are we at? 54. So the product of 6 times 9 is 54. And we replace the unknown in the equation. In this lesson, you learned how to find the product of a multiplication equation using the multiplication table.